welcome back to my channel and for those of you guys seeing my face for the very first time my name is Esmeralda but most people like to call me Esme and if you guys aren't subscribed please make sure to hit the little red button I would really really appreciate it so happy Sunday for you guys it'll be Friday when you're watching this so I hope you guys have had a good week so far for this week's video I thought it would be nice to do a Sunday reset I've been watching a couple of these videos here on YouTube and a few on TikTok the ones that I've seen on TikTok are very aesthetic but I'm gonna be very real with you guys I have a lot to do today so it's not gonna be very peaceful or calm like the ones that I've been seeing so I think there's no better way to start off a new week than by going to church and giving thanks to God for allowing me to get to a new week so I just finished getting ready I got dressed, I did my makeup, and I'm going to be heading out to church for mass. But before I do, I want to show you guys my outfit. So please ignore the mess in the background. I'm going to be doing a lot of cleaning in here today. But for my outfit, I'm wearing this white mock neck sweater that's from Shein. These checkered pants that are from Primark. And for shoes, I decided to throw on my chunky Chelsea boots that have the faux fur lining inside. And then I'm wearing my lucky necklace, my lucky bracelet, this bracelet that Alyssa gave me, and my everyday rings. So I'll catch up with you guys after church. Alright guys, I just got back home and like I mentioned, I have quite a busy day today. So I'm going to go ahead and the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to change my bed sheets and I'm going to put some clean sheets. So let's go ahead and do that. You were my best friend Didn't care about the rules Good on the weekends I'll be in fools drifting so brave and so stupid, just like the movies. How was gonna stay in the fight with you? Just thinking we would do this until we couldn't do it. Each and every high, every night with you. You and me so clueless. We were just broken, shattered, singing along to nothing matters. Straight around like Next on the list is grocery shopping. So I don't have a set date that I usually go to grocery shop. But I was looking in my fridge and in my pantry and I saw that there's a few things that are missing that I would like to go get. But before I head off, I'm gonna go ahead and write my grocery list. I am all done with my list. Also, I have no idea what's going on with my bangs today. I could not style them, so I might have to straighten them when I come back. But I am running a little bit late, so I'm gonna head out to the grocery store now. <music> Hi guys, so a couple of hours have actually gone by since the last clip that you guys saw. I ended up getting home after the grocery store and having to rush to head out to my grandma's because I go visit her on Sundays and so I didn't have time to film a grocery haul for you guys and continue with my reset day. So I'm actually gonna head downstairs and film that grocery haul for you guys really quickly and then I'll get back to everything else. So from the first store, I got some blackberries a couple of blood oranges these two avocados that are not ripe at all I also got some broccoli a box of this Quaker instant oatmeal in the flavor apples and cinnamon as well as their strawberries and cream a box of these pasta shells, some rice vinegar, 
some chili onion crunch, some soy sauce, a packet of Canadian bacon, a box of the Quaker oatmeal squares cereal in the flavor brown sugar, and for snacks, I got these Rice Crisp by the brand Quaker. They're very good. I definitely recommend. Lastly, I got two cartons of this oat milk in the flavor of vanilla and it's by the brand Silk. From the second store, I got these grape tomatoes. Two packages of this thin sliced chicken breast. Some rosemary and olive oil canola. A 12 count package of these non rounds. Stonefire is a great brand, so I'm sure I'm gonna love these. And a cucumber. Alright, so I actually went ahead and changed into a comfier outfit. I'm just wearing some black sweatpants, my slippers, and this t shirt from my high school. And I'm gonna go ahead and open a package that I got in the mail yesterday. Alright, guys, so I got this package in the mail yesterday. As you can see, I already opened it. I just wanted to make sure that everything that I ordered was in here. But I ordered a few things from Amazon, which I rarely do. And some of them are to organize my room. And one of them is this jewelry storage for travel. But I'm going to be using it here in my room. So it is by this brand called Vlando. Never heard of it before. But I got this little case in white. So this is what it looks like it has a little zipper and this is what the inside looks like so it has this little like pouch on top and then it's sectioned off into like three little spaces here i believe you can put necklaces here and then a little spot for rings and then i also ordered a new ring light because the one i had was not working anymore so i got this one right here it's a 10 inch selfie ring light with a tripod stand and the box is actually way smaller than the other one but it had good reviews so i'm gonna go ahead and open this so this is what the inside looks like it comes with the manual i believe this is for the phone I'm not sure what this is for or this honestly <laughs> oh it also has a clicker i did not know that i can take some photos on my own then this is the tripod Okay, so just by the looks of it, it's a lot nicer quality than the one that I had. And I also like the stoppers that they put at the bottom of the legs because the one that I had did not have that. Overall, it looks like it's higher quality than the one that I had, so I'm excited to use it. And it also has 10 levels of brightness and three different light settings. So I'm going to go ahead and put this away. I see you standing there, a soothing atmosphere, smell of your aftershave. All right, now for this, I'm actually going to go ahead and put away my jewelry now. So I usually store my rings in this little box by Pandora. I have like six rings and I put them all in one little box, which is inconvenient. So that's why I bought the other one. And then I have three boxes back here with like bracelets and necklaces so i'm gonna change that up too so i also got this package in the mail not too long ago and it's from pura vida if you guys don't know what they are they're an online jewelry store and honestly some of my favorite pieces are from them so the stuff that i got is from their valentine's collection so i got this heart choker in silver and i'm honestly obsessed with it I also got a bracelet and I very recently started wearing bracelets again so I'm excited to wear this. I believe this is their heart paper clip chain bracelet. It's super simple but I love the little heart accent. And then lastly I got this ring that I'm wearing right here on my pointer finger and I just think that it's super cute. But now I'm going to go ahead and put everything away.
there's one thing that I've been wanting to put away and it's this bag of Christmas gifts. I know I still haven't put them away but it's been sitting on that side of my room and I'm tired of looking at it so it's time to put everything away. First thing I have in here is this acrylic paint set that my mom gave me. If you guys didn't see the Christmas haul that I did on my TikTok make sure you guys go check it out but I'm gonna try to speed through this and I'm not sure where I'm gonna be putting all of this but I am gonna organize some things under my bathroom sink so I'm just gonna go through this. super cute it has my initial and I cannot wait to light it up later to do a haul of my makeup let me know in the comments down below maybe if this video gets around 20 likes then i'll go ahead and do that i am now in my bathroom i'm going to be organizing under my sink like i mentioned earlier okay so i know it looks a little bit crowded and there's a lot going on but i was able to fit in some of the things that i got for christmas by moving some other things around so i'm happy with what it looks like for now so to finish off this sunday reset i'm going to be taking down my christmas decorations and putting up valentine's day decorations and yes i know we're going into february this is actually the longest that I've had my Christmas decorations up for. But now that Valentine's Day is around the corner, I think it's perfect timing to take them down. So let's go ahead and do that. So here are a few of the decorations that I have. I did buy a couple of things, but most of them are from last year. So of course I have some gel clings, which I'm going to be putting up. I also bought these that can hang, and I'm not sure if I'm going to be putting them up in my room or in the bathroom. I got this cute little XOX Stand. it's wooden i also have this little fake succulent that says love you and then i diy'd this in one of my valentine's day videos i'm not sure if it was two years ago but i'm going to be putting these up and this is just a smaller version of that and then i also have this hugs and kisses wooden stand so i can put this like on my desk some heart-shaped confetti these heart lights which I believe should still work. Yep. And lastly, the sign. And I actually tried to erase this last year, but it's still here. But it's okay because it still applies. So I'm just going to be going over it.
guys so i have officially finished everything that i had on my to-do list for today and i don't know if you guys can see it in my face but i am exhausted so i can't wait to go take a shower get in bed and read a book but if you guys enjoy this video please make sure to give it a thumbs up don't forget to turn on my post notifications so that you're notified when my next video goes up and i'll see you guys in my next video bye Thank you.